Hey everyone, it's Captain Rogwash here. Um, I want to do a quick uh, video today about how um, important it is to actually uh, vacuum your rugs properly. Now, um, obviously, rugs can run the floor. Um, I, I do get a lot of rugs that come in, and people have had them as um, entrance matting, um, like in front of their front doors, um, down the hallways, um, and in the lounge. So, obviously, there's going to be a lot of traffic walking in from straight outside, um, actually across the um, rug. Um, now. Obviously, all this is doing is the uh, um, soil and anything you get from outside, grit, stones, sand, um, anything like that. It's on the bottom of your feet. If you don't wipe your feet properly, then it's going into the foundation of the rug. And obviously, it's getting compressed. Every time you walk over, it's getting um, compressed deeper and deeper into the fiber and the backing of the rug. Now, this is damaging because um, obviously, it's, it's abrasive. It's going to act like a knife. And it's going to... Um, start to slowly uh, cut the fibers of the of the rug, uh, creating really ugly wear marks. Um, you'll start to notice um, fibers of the rug actually coming out a little bit. All different sorts of um, situations can come out from um, actually having a lot of soil inside the um, rug. Now we recommend um, um, vacuuming rugs in entrance ways and hallways, ideally a couple of times a week, uh, just to get that soil out. Um, a really good trick to do, probably shouldn't be telling you this, but um, a really good trick to do is to turn the rug upside down so the back is facing upwards um, and run your hoover, preferably a beater bar, across the back of the rug and what this will do, this will drop out all the soil from deep inside and um, it's a really good way of getting all the soil out. Only really use beater bar hoovers on um, machine made rugs, um, rugs without a fringe. Um, they won't do so much damage if you've got a nice fine um, hand knotted rug um, anything like that just be very careful I would hoover it across from left to right on the rug else um, you don't want to go over the fringes because it will pull the uh, tassels out and the knot that's actually on the fringe um, and it could do a lot of damage if you do have nice hand knotted rugs um, I would use um, a Henry style hoover with the flat um, and the flat ends you're just going over the top and keep your beater bar for um, like machine made rugs and um, things like that. So that's a great way of um, a weekly maintenance you can do on your rugs um, just to keep all that uh, damaging dry soil out of the rug. Um, if you have any questions um, about um, what I'll talk to you about hoovering um, then please feel free to leave me a comment on the bottom or you can email me or uh, give the office a ring. Um, but yeah just doing that simple uh, once a week at the very least hoovering of the rugs would be absolutely perfect and it'll stop your rugs from getting ugly wear marks and um and damaging the rug. Alright guys, thanks for watching another episode and um I look forward to seeing you soon. Okay, bye.